the cake. Oh, oh, look how pretty it is. Well, go away. <laughs> oh no. Oh. It's so pretty. Hey y'all, hey, it's Sunday. It is Sunday. It is and Sunday. It is 12 o'clock in the afternoon. It's 12 o'clock in the afternoon. We just <laughs> hold on, fit check. Um <laughs> Well they can't see. <laughs> it's cold in the room. I'm not taking these off until I need to, which is actually right now because I need to put my shoes on. But um in the afternoon we just got up like an hour ago because we were dying yesterday was rough she was really rough she was very rough it was very physically demanding you're physically demanding we did that we did a haunted tour and we literally had to walk and stand the entire time walk and stand the entire time it was two hours um, long which i've done before and i should have remembered that that's what it was <laughs> i know i remember when we walked when we walked off i and everyone started moving. I was like, are we walking this whole thing? And Paul was like, ah, yeah. And I was like, ah, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Yeah, I forgot about that part. It was fun when I was able-bodied. Um, I mean, no, it was, still, it was fun. It was still fun. No, I had a great time. It was still cool, just, you know, a little bit. It was just hard. Yeah. <laughs> just like a little bit. Um, you know, I saw other people sitting down. And, and then I was like, I was like, damn, if this is hard for other people, then I feel validated. Right? So, uh, well, and it's just so, and then in the heat, yeah, it was, it was rough, it would be rough for anyone. So, um, uh, in the comments below, tell me, um, what your heat tolerance is like. Guys, look what we got for tonight. Oh, we got, oh yeah, oh, mom, don't call me right now, I'm vlogging. Also, tonight is, uh, New Orleans Pride, we found out, so... <laughs> We went shopping and I spent a hundred dollars I did not need to spend. A little nervous. Where's, where's her boobs? Are you kidding? <laughs> Are you kidding? All right, we just left the hotel room. Um, we're headed to the Museum of Death, which is <laughs> super cool. Brady's fit of the day is very boring because. Um, I left her cape at my hotel room. Oh, I forgot earrings again. I hate it here, now I'm naked. I almost fell. Boxes, boxing. I think they're all just wearing harnesses today, no cape. No capes, no capes. He's also booted and she's upsetting about it. My dog is always booted. I'm really anal about his feet, so. But at least your dog is fine in his boots. Yeah, he loves his boots. Whereas mine is a little <laughs> baby. Oh, hi. So we're going to the Museum of Death, and apparently you can't take any photos or videos inside, which is kind of the issue we've ran into a lot of places we go to, like all the really cool, um, like just like the voodoo shop. A lot of them you can't film or take photos in, which is gonna be the same case at the museum. So, it, it, I filmed in Marie Laveau's by accident. Well, like, I was filming and I didn't know you put it and I got yelled at. I know, I we were both filming. Like, I think I got like a two second clip of the floor, which I'll probably leave out of the video for Stop respect. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but, um, but yeah, because I didn't know. But it's all right. This is the only potty spot that we can even find. There's we. <laughs> She needed to go potty very bad because we can only come here so often. Um, there's almost no grass anywhere. And the only place where there is grass is not pet friendly, which, you know, isn't an issue, but they won't let us. Hey, I found a dollar. Anyways, um, yeah. So the grassy areas, like they're not 
pet friendly and then we've just had issues with letting the dogs go potty there in general because like they're anal about us having them off leash which like you know it, we got to let them off leash a little bit to just you know go potty it's not like they're running amok but to be fair there were no signs are you all done she said i'm all done mommy um there's no signs that say there's no pets allowed or anything but okay good night we Hi, my wee. Hi, wee's a pretty girl. Are you kidding? You own a literal giant hamster. <laughs> also, I'm putting a disclaimer. I want to hear shit about masks. We are fully vaccinated. It's not required to wear them here. Everywhere that does require them, we wear them, obviously. And we do wear them on Bourbon Street when it's yeah. really crowded. Yeah, because Bourbon, Bourbon Street's Street's one now. exception where I want to wear masks. I put mine on immediately last night when we were walking down Yeah, because it's disgusting it's and there's a lot bush. of people. Yeah, I know. Okay. He does that. This is the legendary Cleo's. Um, That's my safe food. It's a little it's convenience Hunter's store, safe Hunter's Safe Food, where she's I'm eaten stop every single what night. I'm saying. <laughs> she's eaten there every single night since we got here. <laughs> um, yeah, they got good. <laughs> It's, it's gluten-free and vegan. Mm -hmm. It's Mediterranean food, yeah. but it's like a little like hole-in-the-wall convenience store and there's just a little restaurant inside, which is pretty sick. So Hunter and Amanda's hotel room is like more in the like modern city area. Um, my hotel room was on Bourbon Street and I couldn't sleep. Loud, so I've ended up staying at their hotel room every night after the first night because I can sleep there, so. We just left the Museum of Death. Uh, it was cool. It wasn't like as spooky scary as I thought it would be. Then again, rude. Then again, like not a whole lot faces us. So we're gonna go meet my parents for breakfast, lunch. We haven't eaten yet. I'm, I'm starting to feel, it is two o'clock, so lunch, but we haven't eaten yet. So um, I'm starting to feel that actually right now because there was a lot of standing in there. Very busy. Me too. So that's good in it. Now comes the trouble of finding somewhere we can all eat because all of us have dietary restrictions. So yeah that's that makes it a little difficult um but we're gonna go meet my parents in jackson square give the dogs a little break water potty um because it's like one of the very few places that actually has grass here so a little dr seuss gallery how cute oh yeah okay that's less cute then all right, we stopped in Jackson Square to let the dogs have a potty break and we sat in the shade for a bit. And then um, we finally found somewhere to eat. It's um, an Italian place, so kind of a girl. So um, they have gluten-free options, they have vegetarian options. So we're headed there now. Um, there was a guy swimming, sorry, I pick up. There was a guy swimming in that fountain earlier. So that was cool. Here's the, what is it, what is this called? Church, I guess? Yeah. But she do be pretty. And so this is the, this is Jackson Square. This is pretty cool. Uh, Bucks, I know! <laughs> Bucks' boot is on backwards. No, it's not even on his foot. Oh, that's awkward. Oh, it just the Velcro's on. If you're debating on buying um, PetSmart brand, don't. Yeah. We found a place to eat. Hunter's overwhelmed with her options. Very good. Very, very, very vegan and vegetarian friendly. Mm -hmm. as well. um, we're dying. Hopefully we get our food. The, so, com the combination of us not having eaten anything yet today, walking in the sun and trying to not die. Yeah. We. It's been really hard. Our bodies are 
Yeah, yesterday was really rough. And even this morning, like, you know, it's like... So, after this, depending how we feel, I do, I you know. We fell asleep during the movie last night. Um, depending how we feel after this, we're either gonna go shop a bit or go back to the hotel room. Um, uh, 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 tonight we have a ferry boat to go on at around 6. There's dinner on the boat, I want to say. Um, hopefully they have options for us. Then after that, we're gonna rest, get ready for the gayest night of our lives. We're gonna go to New Orleans Pride for however long I'm we so can. I'm so excited that Pride's happening while we're there. I know. I thought it might be, but I couldn't find any dates when I had looked it up. I don't know how long we're gonna be able to be out there though, like an hour if that, but we're gonna have a fun time. Oh, obviously, we're gonna have a fun time while it lasts. We just left lunch, we feel a thousand times better. Um, it's hot as <laughs> still, but we've eaten now at least. And my parentals came and met us. So, hey. Shut it back there. Oh, Look at the yellow boy. Is she cute? Oh, thank you. Um, I don't see. I don't know. It's a baby. So, leave it. Leave it. Oh, I'm sorry, babe. I tripped on her. Good girl. Good job. Don't fall in any hole. Right? Oh my god. That was a young baby. It did. That was cute. The dog had a little pouch on its uh, harness that said, best friend. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. There were patches at the Death Museum, and I was like, oh, I don't need one. I literally still need a New Orleans patch. Alright, anyways, um, I forget what I was talking about. Bye. We just went into a really beautiful little witchery shop and we're headed to they have like a sister store right here um i didn't see anything about not filming in there but i just want to be safe I don't want to disrespect so um we did get a few small items which are really really cool and now we're headed over to the what sure that's pretty funny but now we're headed into the sister store see what they got. All right, so we just left the other store. It was very cute, too. very similar. Oh, so the... found that costume shop. You did? It's up here. Really? Oh, there is an outfit I want, I want you to have so bad. The... We stopped there, had a little retro store, and we wanted to get dresses for Dapper Day for Disney, but the ones we wanted, well, the one she really wanted didn't have her size, and the one I really, really wanted was really expensive, but I wanted it so bad. It was the cherry dresses that they used to have at Roadkill. Awesome. Remember those? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what? I got it on video. Why is it in there? Good girl, Ridley. Good girl, Rid. That thing card is coming from like three stores down. I know, right? Good girl. Good puppies. Didn't even care. Good girl. Here. Good job. Yeah. Hey. Did you good? Yeah. Did air feel good? Go potty with you. Oh my god, it is front booty. Oh no, they're all backwards. <laughs> Ridley's upset. She said, I'm just trying to take a. Come here. Please, please. Hi, Stinky. Go potty. No? Okay. Stinky wee smells bad. Stinky not stinky not stinky stinky ugly stinky ugly stinky ugly stinky. Stinky stinky ugly stinky ugly. Get it off me. Stinky box stinky box stinky 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 box stinky box stinky box stinky wee. Yummy wee. Who are you? Do you mind? Hello? What are you doing there wee? Oh wee. What are you doing? Look at that. What are you doing? This kid just ate shit. What? Nice. And that kid just, just watched that kid eat shit. <laughs>
<laughs> Smells bad. Yeah, that's you. Head down. Ew. <laughs> Just make noise. Can he put his head in the camera? Yeah. Ew. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, good night, Wee. stormy weather it's gonna rain most likely hopefully no bit bad thunder because it's spooky scary but i'll have a panic attack yeah well we're supposed to go on a ferry in an hour so that should be interesting <laughs> we were literally sitting here like wow this weather's so nice but we should have known yeah because it actually feels cool like right now there's a nice breeze there's no direct sun but it's starting to pick up and be a little a little a little whew, windy Ooh. Yeah, I guess. Before it does start the downpour. Oh no, I didn't Hi. see Jay cut that out. <laughs> Alright, my parents got out of the table for us at a cafe, so we're gonna go walk Papa over there. Bird. Yeah, we're gonna get beignets finally. Yeah, they felt bad. Thank you, Amanda. Oh, oh people are taking a picture. We're gonna wait. Back up. Thank you. Did you guys know like that, that Ridley is stinky ugly? Ridley is stinky ugly. That's stinky, so ugly, stinky, <laughs> stinky, ugly. <laughs> Finished our beignets. We're heading to the boat now. Hopefully, gonna get a seat inside because it is most definitely gonna be storming and raining. Um, yeah, I said the rain is supposed to start in about probably now 10 minutes. That music is horrifying. I feel like we're gonna go die, but like it's cool, I guess. So, we're here, and the line is extremely long. Also, the music makes me want to aliven so um the line is extremely long though so we're gonna see what we can do about that yucky he's yucky that's so rude oh my have god you, what is that have you ever considered no that's yucky Why do you get crazy oh, eyes? Uh, I don't know if y'all can hear that. Do it again. Uh. <laughs> you hear me? He That's disgusting, it. and I hate that he likes yeah. that. Ew! Wee? <laughs> oui? ah. Hi, Wee. Want to go? You're so pretty. You've been so good today. Oh, so we took her boots off because it's cool now. We just got our photos taken and it was really cute. We had the dogs posed on either side of that and then um, oh God. we had the dogs posed on either side of the, the thing and then um, 
Noxus had his head through it, which was cute. Oh. Good girl. Hang on. Slow. Good girl. Good girl. Very gloomy, but like in a cool way. Inside, maybe up high. All right, Anna, with me. Yes, good girl. Good, you did it. Yes. Okay. Never mind. We're doing stairs. Okay. Slow. Good. Good. Good girl. All right, slowly. Good, yes. Good job, Reed. Very nice. All right, enough with me. Go anywhere. Here and you guys go out. You're welcome. And we're gonna go up and see what's up. Okay. See if you find a table, call us. Okay. I'll go with you, Mom. Ow! Sorry, honey. Uh huh. Follow. This is pretty in here. There is some. Later. So the ferry boat did not go as planned. It was not friendly to those with any sensory issues whatsoever. It's extremely literally a thunderstorm. It was extremely loud inside and outside is a thunderstorm and that's outside, a no-go. Outside would have been okay in sans the yeah. Oh outside would have been perfect and good weather right now sans this other actual thunderstorm happening outside so yeah like uh, big thunder. Not just big thunder. no no it was not baby thunder that was big thunder. that was that was that was nola thunder that was like Florida thunder. yeah that was southern the southern thunder so yeah that didn't work out but um we're able to get a refund on our tickets my parents stayed on the boat so they're just gonna go do that we are getting an Uber back to the room. Gonna probably just order food. We'll probably just watch movies and chill and rest. Yeah, we didn't finish for well, well, well. 
we didn't, Amanda and I fell asleep during Corella last night, so we'll probably finish that. Yeah, and then later on we still got Pride. Hopefully the weather's gonna clear up. It usually only lasts like a couple hours and then it's done, or even just a couple minutes, so. It didn't look like a whole it was gonna be 10 p.m.? Oh, it's gonna just be starting at 10 p.m. Yeah. Pride's just going to be starting at 10 p.m. is what I mean. Yeah. So. And we're not going to be out that late, most likely, because we have to get up early, but, you know. Anywho, so, yeah, dogs are good. They are being very tolerant. They were literally, like, there was a live band five feet away from us, and they were just like. Sleeping. They were sleeping, yeah. They didn't, did not care. They do not care, so good for them. Yeah, we're literally freaking out. They're just like, so that's on desensitization and just having good dogs, I guess. I don't know, like they're, they're cool sometimes. Yeah, they're good sometimes. Sometimes. Later. So we've literally been turned away from Lyft three times. We're being turned away for a third time right now. We're, Hunter's literally in the middle of a f***ing episode and none of the drivers want to like take us to take us to our hotel because of the dogs which is like super super great so yeah I don't know what to do come here good girl we're just standing on the curb now So the last Uber ended up letting us in after all because got turned away by three separate Ubers. But we managed to convince the last one to take us basically because we were like, dude, our friend's literally a medical so at first she was, at first he was like no dogs and we were like, okay, it literally states in your policy you have to let us on. And then he was like, Okay, well they're not gonna fit and I'm like, Well they'll fit. We should have told him, like, bro, you we fit them in a Kia Soul yesterday. Okay, so the first one showed up, didn't want to let us in. We were like, we told him, I'm like, is it's in your policy? Or you told him, it's like, it's in your policy. Either you let us in or we call. The second one just drove past us. Like, like I don't even I know think, what happened. Come here, I Red. I went up to her car and she saw Noxus, move. And she just, like, and she just, she just she, drove away. She just drove away. Like, a screenshot of her thing? So then. Yeah, I saw you take a screenshot of your message to her that you, when you told her she passed us and she didn't reply. I saw you screenshot that at least. Because it automatically, Uber just like called us another one because she got really far away. Because, you know, she just kept driving. Uber or Lyft? Ooh, a Lyft, I'm Lyft. sorry. Uh, so three in a row, which was really cool. And it was literally raining. We were standing out in the rain. I was literally having a panic. Hunter was dying. <laughs> Yeah, and I told him, I was like, my friend needs to get out of here. And I was like, three, I said to him, I said, three people have turned us away. Like, we're standing here in the rain. Like, the wetter these dogs get, the more they're going to smell, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if your issues about them being wet, they're just going to get wetter. They're not gonna fit. I can't fit three dogs in my car. And I was like, I was like, they'll sit on the ground. They won't even. They won't even touch your seats. And he and he was like, they're not gonna fit though. And I was like, yes, I buddy, they them. gonna fit. They, that just goes to show when like when people like sign up to do this job, they don't <laughs> read the policy. No. When I know for a fact it's a big thing on their policy. Hang on. Yeah, when you read the policy, I'm I'll insert call. a photo because it's really like well written. Like yeah, it's really like I'm it really advocates list. for us. I'm calling the Lyft hotline again, the service dog hotline. Yeah. Oh, there's a service dog specific hotline? It is a service dog specific hotline. Yeah, because, because they're they very know. accommodating, yeah. but the drivers Hello? don't. Um, yeah, uh, we were just picked up by, well, we, we weren't picked up, but we had a Lyft driver cancel on us because of our service animals, and I just wanted to call to report it because this is the second time this has happened to us, and it's very frustrating. Yes, the name of the driver was. Uh, any more details, Amanda? This
Okay, thank you so much. Bye, you too. Restaurants give us stupid excuses for, for these it's things. It's just not service Well, dogs. you could tell there's pets everywhere and no service dogs. So I feel like pets have just been abusing it yeah, and then all over the place. And so then when once in a blue moon a service dog comes up, they don't know what the Quack. to do. Yeah, this has been fun. That was a fun experience. No, it wasn't. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I'm changed now. We're gonna still do pride later. Yay! Maybe. Hopefully. Hi, sleepy. Hi, wee. Hi, sleepy. Thank you, Sirius. I'm well aware. <laughs> Sirius is alerting. She, buddy, the episode's like over now. He's like, it's she, not though. She's. She knows it happened. There's a thirty percent chance it's already raining. <laughs> later that same evening. All right, so we hung out in the room for a little bit, uh, rested, and then decided that we were just gonna stay there. So, no pride tonight after all. Sorry. It's all Amanda's fault, no. I feel really bad. No, it, you're fine, I'm, on, I'm tired. I'm honestly just that little walk to go take them, like my, my belly hurts a little bit. Come here. Like the, like, you know when you get like the tired like cramps? Okay. Like you just, uh, I'm having those. So, yeah. <laughs> so we went and took the dogs out to go potty, and then we stopped at the infamous Cleo's once again. For, if you ever go to New Orleans, support local small business Cleo's. So we're back at the hotel now. Gonna head up to the room and rest. I feel like we're so lame compared to everybody else this year on vacation, because we're just like, we all right, we're, all right. We did what we wanted. Let's go home now. <laughs> we did what we wanted. Back to the room. I know. I'm joking. Cool. Birthday. They check the keys? I think they told us. What do you mean? That like each time we came back in that they were gonna check to make sure we always had a key on them. Oh. Once we get in our room, but also to make sure- But I've also been with you every single time. Yeah, but when you checked in the room as well. Well, my parents paid for three people at my hotel and I've been there one night. So, you know, there's that. I knew that was gonna happen. I know. Hi, we. Yeah, it's like it's a bit of a walk, but coming here at night to quiet is sweet. It's very nice and quiet. Oh, Hunter's vlogging. Vlog section. Whoa, I look like that right now. Ooh. Don't say that about yourself. Here's what I was talking about. Here's the fit. Here's the fit. Here's the fit. I wish it were me.